Hey, it's Tactical Hearing again. We're going to talk today a little bit about our instrument and the different settings that it offers. These are our custom units. This particular one here is our T24 Raptor. This is an aviation model. We've added some uh, different uh, features in this compression technology and the circuitry and the microprocessor that are going to help with, with extreme noise, background noise, continuous noise, and the programming for decibel levels to give you the maximum protection in that specific environment. Something that all of our custom units do that uh, we want to focus on in this little presentation each one of our, our custom units offer a volume control. You can reach here and, uh, while it's in your ear and just control that volume. That takes you up, it takes you down. Now each of our instruments also have different modes that, uh, that are pre-programmed within the device on top of the custom programming for each individual's specific hearing. And what you find here is you've got a little button. You'll tap that little button while it's in your ear and you're going to hear it beep one time. You tap it again, it'll give you two beeps. Again, three beeps, four beeps, and back to one. Defaults back to one. The battery sits right in a little compartment here. You'll notice that you put the battery inside the door of the instrument. Then you'll close the, the device. When you're resting the device, it's always good in the evening to open that or take the battery out completely. It'll help give you another day or half day worth of battery uh, usage. So back to the little button. These modes are specific for different environments, different situations. More gain, more compression for protection. A uh, good rule of thumb is the quieter the background that you're in, the lower the number you want to be on. Uh, in a hunting application or a tactical or law enforcement setting, when you want maximum gain, you'll go to that number one mode. It's going to give you bionic super hearing, six to eight times your normal hearing capabilities. Uh, when you're in a noisy environment, such as the cockpit of a noisy airplane or a shooting range or someplace where there's a tremendous amount of background noise, heavy equipment, construction sites, you're going to want to be on that fourth setting. That's going to give you your maximum compression for uh, the protection. Now within this uh, microprocessor, that detects sound at 85 decibels. So anything beyond that range is instantly compressed to a safe level, protecting you from damage. And it happens in a split second. On a shooting range, uh, with down the line, you cannot pull the trigger fast enough to beat that circuit. It happens in milliseconds you're in a noisy cockpit or an industrial setting, there's compressors or things working, this is continually giving you that protection while giving you the ability to hear simultaneously. Um, uh, we appreciate it. Thanks for listening to our uh, this little presentation. The modes are very important. Once again, one, two, three, four. The quieter the background, the lower the setting, the louder the background, the higher the setting. Tacticalhearing.com, give us a call, we'll walk you through any information that you need that we haven't covered here. Take care.